Hi there, I'm Brad with Splash Damage Tech. This is my first video on this channel and I've got a brand new product that's out today. The Barnes & Noble Nook Tablet 10.1 inch. These are available in stores as of today, November the 14th, 2018. I picked this one up at a local Barnes & Noble store this morning and I couldn't wait to get it unboxed. So let's get it out of there. Included is obviously the Nook 10.1 inch tablet. We'll put that aside for now. Then we have a quick start guide. Also included is a pretty chunky micro USB cable as well as a wall charger which does look to be a 5 volt 2 amp charger let's check out the device quickly on the front You'll see the front facing camera as well as an ambient light sensor. The rear has a rear facing camera up top, some regulatory info, and a small Nook logo. On the bottom or the left in portrait mode, there are pogo pins for connecting the optional keyboard cover. On the right, there's a power button, volume up and down. The bottom shows two separate stereo speakers. And on the top, a micro USB port, 3.5 millimeter headphone jack, and what appear to be microphones. So let's get this plastic off and start it up. And while that's happening, let's go over the specs. Up until now, the specs of this Nook Tablet 10.1 inch have been a little murky, so here they are in all their quite unspectacular glory. This tablet is running an Android 8.1 Oreo with the security patch as of August 5th, 2018. It's rocking a pretty low powered chip, the MediaTek MT8167A. That's a quad-core ARM Cortex-A35 running at a maximum of 1.5 GHz. The onboard GPU is a PowerVR GE8300, and this system on a chip is paired with 2 GB of RAM, but what speed or spec I'm not sure of yet. The onboard storage is 32 GB with 25.3 GB free on first boot. The screen is a 10.1 inch, obviously, IPS LCD with a resolution of 1920 by 1200. Wi-Fi is pretty healthy, 802.11 ABGN and AC dual band, so both 2.4 and 5 GHz are supported. The Bluetooth is 4.1 and it does support low energy. The tablet has two cameras, both 1.9 megapixel. The front camera can shoot video at a maximum of 480p and the rear camera can do 720p. There are two speakers that play in stereo on the bottom or the right of the tablet depending on how you're holding it. And the battery is listed at 6,300 milliamp hours. I hope you enjoyed this short unboxing and first look at the Nook Tablet 10.1 inch. If you found this useful, I'd appreciate a thumbs up and consider subscribing if you'd like to see more about this brand new Nook Tablet. I've got some accessories for the tablet on the way and a full review video coming soon. That's all for this one, so thank you for watching and have a great day.